Namaste, what's going on? Welcome to Powerhouse Tarot. I am Energy Goddess. Welcome to my Lit Growing YouTube. I like to do different spiritual related videos and content. If you enjoy it here, make sure you hit the subscription button down below as well as the post notification bell. Okay, let's get into it. We got a bonus reading this week. We got Capricorn coming out. So let's get the messages for Capricorn. Big Cat, what is coming out for my Capricorns this week? Capricorn bonus read. What is coming out for my Capricorn for this bonus reading? Okay, clarity, truth, and a present situation. I see clarity. I see truth. I see you being guided by your spirit. There's some sort of wake up call that's happening for Capricorn this week. Like Capricorn is being woken up. Okay, spirit is not playing. And it's like you're heeding the call. Okay. The flesh is heeding the call, is listening to their spirit, okay? You've had a moment of clarity this week. Ooh, I love it for you. Yeah, a lot of support, emotional support, like outpouring. Could be like a new baby, new something on the way for my Capricorns. Ooh, I love it for you. Mm, the star, trusting your intuition. So it's like you're getting, your your uh, intuition is getting stronger, I'm hearing. Ooh, didn't I say it was getting stronger? Your intuition is getting stronger. Ooh, I'm getting chills. Ooh, Capricorn, yes. Yes! Yes, come through, Capricorn. You better, you better. You better, you better do what you gotta do. I'm not playing with you, Capricorn, this week. <laughs> Yeah, you had to learn some tough lessons. And I mean, that was part of it, right? You know what I'm saying? So this week, you definitely learn some tough lessons, get some clarity, gaining clarity on the tough lessons, okay? Not just learning the tough lessons, okay? They're done, no rehashing it. But actually going back, like, let me take a page out that book because I might need this in the future. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, taking real account of everything that you've been through all the way up to this point for my Capricorns this week. Okay. It could be a very important decision that I feel like you're going to have to make this week. The chariot, the judgment, I'm seeing it. Very tough decision, okay? It's a personal decision. The empress, I feel like you're very creative. Creative sparks could be flowing all around you. Like you're getting an idea to do something different or change it up, do something. Um, you're very creative and talented, Capricorn. I feel like go after that, chase that, whatever that is. You know what I'm saying? For you, Capricorn. Some more here, Holy Spirit, for Capricorn this week. Tell me more here for Capricorns this week. What can Capricorns this week look forward to? Oh, okay. So, yeah. So, there's something from the past. I feel like you're making a decision this week, Capricorn, about something that you were rushing into from the past. It's like now you've taken into account that you did rush into that situation. And although you didn't get what you wanted, it still was a win-win outcome. Whatever it happened or transpired from that event. Um, I feel like it's a win-win outcome for some of you guys. Um, I'm getting some of you guys might even be pregnant with Ace of Cups. Not lying. No lies, okay? But I just really see you overall um, in your outcome here at Capricorn this week. Like, really being happy, celebrating your um, happy home life. Um, success, success, victories, family, um, support a lot this week. That's what I really see you, like, really experiencing this week. Tell me more. What, what do we got from the angels and, and our uh, ancestors and guides? Okay, okay, make plans and make focus, so it's like whatever plans that you're making, make focus, focus on them, you also have about fairy energy, I'm definitely getting from my, my uh, Capricorns, you got fairy energy, you have strong bond with the fairies, and your life purpose involves helping mother nature, okay, Capricorn, do not forget that, also you have bottom of the deck of integrity, okay, so this week is going to be a huge focus on integrity, it's like you've had a wake-up call about that, just period. You just want to be a person, a wholesome person, a person of integrity, just period. You the GOAT. You already know. You're the greatest of all times, G. Of course, that's how you're trying to rock. What's going on? What's tell me more for uh, Capricorn this week? Anything else uh, Capricorn can look forward to this week? Okay, be the light. Yeah, white witch. So it's like this week, you're definitely going to be having like a huge theme about, you know, being the light. Okay, being the knowledge. Mm. Maybe even teaching people by just you being the white witch, being the light. Okay, heart chakra. So this week, you'll definitely be working out of that space of your heart chakra. Mm, the Anandhata. 
the answer that you seek is in your heart right now. Be open to giving and receiving love, okay? It's like people are trying to reach out to you, help you out, like, during a, a very pressing and trying time of your life right now. And I feel like reach out for, the, for them because they, they're definitely going to help you um, keep focused on your plans, okay? Shield Maiden, they're, like, protecting you, you know? So that's a big message for my Capricorn too this week. Oh, I'm getting chills. Ooh. Ooh, I'm getting chills this week. I'm getting chills this week about my Capricorns. What is going on? Let me give you some of these. It's the process. I trust the process of life, it says. I trust the process of life. Please, Capricorn, this week. Trust the process of life. There is a rhythm and I flow to life and I am part of it. Life supports me and brings me only good and positive experiences. I trust the process of life to bring me my highest good. Also, speak these affirmations, okay? Bring me good things. Okay, I trust the process of life. Okay, to bring me good things. Even say, bring me good things. Okay, command it. All right, all right, guys and goddesses. My work is deeply fulfilling. I also see that for you, Capricorn. Like, whatever you do for work, like, you're fulfilled by it. Today, I give my best to that which I, which I do, knowing that when one experience is complete, I am led to even more fulfilling and rewarding experiences. Okay. My work is deeply fulfilling. So whatever it is you do, Capricorn, for work, I feel like there's this creative spark, like I was saying, um, within you with this Empress energy. And I feel like maybe you'll be taking some sort of leap or some sort of risk this week or just in the future for my Capricorns um, to do with work. Because whatever you do is fulfilling and it helps you. And you know that if it helps you, it can help other people. So that might be something that you may be looking into in the future for my Capricorns. But this is what I got for y'all bonus three. Let me know how y'all like this one down below. I love y'all. Bye.